Amplitude 3 adds a complete multi-track studio, making it the most comprehensive guitar and audio production app available. Amplitude gives you a new timeline audio editing suite for arranging, editing, mixing, and mastering. When first open, the studio view is split into two sections, the track control section on the left and the waveform display with timeline grid on the right. You can tap any waveform to access the controls for that track. You can adjust how much of the track signal goes to the master effects section, pan control for placing the track in the stereo field, and a fader for fine-tuning the volume level of the track. Here you'll find the mute, solo, arm, and effects controls. The effects button allows you to enable or disable the amplitude chain on the selected track. At the bottom of the screen is the main transport control. Record, play, rewind, and metronome, plus undo and redo commands. And there's also a grid button that turns grid snapping on and off. The overview button to show and hide the navigation bar. At the core of the studio module is the waveform display section. Here you can select audio material by touching the waveform display, then perform multiple types of edits. Cut, copy, copy track, delete region, delete the track, normalize the volume, or split at the playhead. Plus, audio can be moved ahead in the timeline or repositioned simply by touching and holding the waveform, then dragging around on the screen. Creating a fade is as simple as selecting the region you want to fade, then dragging the triangle on the top left corner of the region to the right to create a fade in. Creating a fade out is done the same way. Cropping an audio region is done in a similar way. You can define the loop start and end points by dragging from left to right. Once defined, double tap on the green area to activate it. Drag from right to left in the navigation bar and you can create a red punch-in section. You can zoom in or out on a region by pinching in or out with two fingers on the screen. To get more screen real estate, you can hide the track control section by swiping to the left on the black handle. Just below the navigation bar is the loop drummer track. If you've programmed a killer drum track using the built-in loop drummer feature, it shows up in this track. You can edit your drum sequence in the track by touching and dragging the parts around. A double tap on the drum part will duplicate it to the right of the original, making quick work of adding an awesome, professionally recorded rhythm track. All-in-one solution, unmatched sound quality, guitar tone, recording flexibility, and ease of use for the serious mobile musician. Amplitude 3, 